G'day folks, I'm out for a ride. Well, I'm not right now. <laughs> I'm on my way home. I've probably been riding for an hour and a half or something. And uh, out on the scooter, the famous scooter. Actually, lots of people have asked me about the scooter and, uh, and how they can find them or whatever. So if you're interested in finding more about the scooter, don't Google adult scooter or anything like that. Look up foot bike. And foot bike is what they call those things. And, uh, and if you want to know the brand of mine, it's kick bike. Just look up kick bike. And uh, yeah, mine, it's a foot bike and the, the brand that I ride is kick bike. There you go. So yesterday, uh, I don't know if you watched my, uh, my weigh-in video yesterday, it wasn't, there wasn't a lot of detail in it on, uh, on my thoughts and stuff because I forgot to do it until I was out on a, on a date night with my wife, Mandy, seeing a band. And uh, so it was more about being out on a date night rather than on, on uh, weigh-in stuff. So I thought I'd talk a little bit more about, uh, about that sort of stuff right now. I'm, uh, sorry, I'm still moving around too much. When I make these things and I'm out riding, I'm in the middle of exercising and I feel full of energy and I want to keep on moving. So, uh, but that makes people dizzy. So I'm sitting on a bench now, sitting on a bench. And, uh, and the reason I'm sitting on a bench is in an effort to try to uh, stay still as much as I can. But I still find myself elbows on my knees, talking to the phone and then sitting back up. So I'm sorry about that, I'm trying my best. Anyway, uh, so I weighed in and uh, last week, as of yesterday, I put on 0.1 of a kilo, so only 100 grams, it's not that much. And uh, it's a, it was a, it's hard, it's hard not to be disappointed that I put weight on, but uh, as I've said many times before, uh, this whole uh, experiment is not uh, about weight loss for me. It is about um, it is about trying to control a food addiction, and it's about trying to uh, treat a food addiction in the same way you'd treat a drug or an alcohol addiction, which is to quit cold turkey and never do it again. And uh, and yeah, obviously you can't do that with food. So I decided to try to. Um, I decided to try to get as close as I could to quitting food cold turkey and that was just to choose one food, uh, see if I could find a food that I could live off uh, healthily for an extended period of time and, uh, and do that and see how it affects my addiction. Um, so I set it on potatoes and, uh, and I've gone to great pains to emphasize that that is what this challenge is about. It's about addiction. And it's about trying to treat addiction. I just had a little moth land on my neck. I'll fly away from my neck. There he is. Hello. How you going there, mate? Little moth. Having a good time there. Um, so, yeah, I've gone to uh, great pains to emphasize that it's not about... Uh, about weight loss and it's about treating an addiction. But on my ride, I've been thinking about that because not having lost weight, it's hard not to feel at least a little bit of disappointment but since, it's, since I've been losing weight every week. And uh, so I'm not, I'm not like super upset about it. I, I would rather be losing weight than putting weight on. There's no doubt about that, but hey, I'll move on and, and I'm sure I'll lose more weight and I'm not worried about that at all. But it, nonetheless, it has got me thinking about uh, my whole reasons for doing this. And I guess, even though I have been saying, and I believe it, and I 100% believe it, and it still is what I think, that, it, that this is all about treating an addiction, I guess the point is, if I, if I boil it all down to how I arrived and, and what this is really, truly all about, um, yeah, I guess it does probably boil down to, in its essence, it would be about, well, two things really. It would be about being healthy and being fitter and also, yeah, losing weight. Um, yeah, I guess that is, that is it, the essence of my reasons behind this. Um, I do, it is important, I think, to be in touch with that and, uh, and acknowledge it and, um, and, yeah, be okay with that as well. But, uh, 
Yeah, the reason that this is different though is that in the past when I've made efforts to change the way I eat or change the way I exercise or just change the way I live my life in general, it's usually been with the aim, specific aim in mind of losing weight and that's that. But this time, the aim is of the number one, sorry, not the aim, the number one focus, I should call it a focus really, the number one focus of this is to uh, try to control the addiction to food that I have and uh, try to learn to think about food differently, see it more as a fuel rather than a source of pleasure or emotional comfort and support and, uh, and yeah, have a more healthy and, uh, and uh, happier relationship with food than I have in the past. And I've figured that if I can uh, take control of that and, uh, and get on top of the food addiction, then the weight loss will be a byproduct of that. It will, the weight loss will take care of itself if I can do that. And, uh, and that is what's happened so far. I didn't expect it to be so quick and, uh, and such a, a big amount of weight all at the same time. Well, not all at the same time, but in such a hurry. And, uh, so yeah, that, that has been a, a big success of it and I'm very happy about it. But uh, I do have to remind myself that I, although uh, it is an aim of mine to be lean and to lose weight, that I need to keep my focus on controlling a food addiction and just allow the weight thing to happen on its own and accept that some weeks I'm going to put on 100 grams. Maybe some weeks I'll put on two kilos. Some weeks I'll lose weight and I, and I expect that, uh, you know, over the course of the year, I will lose much more weight than I've already lost. But even if I don't, that's, I still have to continue with, uh, as long as I'm feeling healthy and happy and, uh, and I'm feeling like it's effective in controlling my addiction and I'll, I'll continue on and, uh, and my resolve has not waned since yesterday since weighing in a little bit heavier than I was the week before I it's not changed my thoughts on whether I want to do the year it's not changed anything really other than just to you know make me slightly disappointed about putting on weight but hey it's gonna happen isn't it anyway that's my thoughts for the day. Uh, yeah, I just thought it was important to talk about and acknowledge that this, uh, you know, the true essence boiled down to its, uh, to the, you know, the essence of why I'm doing this. Yeah, it is about losing weight. It is about getting healthier and uh, being fitter than I have been. And. Uh, and yeah, controlling my addiction and eating potatoes is just a vehicle to achieve that. And, uh, and so that has to be the focus. If I focus on the process, which is eating potatoes and controlling my addiction, then the results, health and happiness and, uh, and fitness, they're going to come anyway. There's no need to focus on those things. I need to focus on the process, which is controlling food addiction, eating potatoes. So there you go. I think that covers it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. Thanks for visiting spudfit.com and signing up for my newsletter, which I haven't sent one uh, version of yet, but uh, I'll send one at some stage and I promise it won't be spam. So sign up if you want that, spudfit.com. Like my Facebook page if you want to keep up with me there. Subscribe to my YouTube channel below and uh, make comments and ask questions and all that sort of gear. And thank you for watching and spud up.